look. <laughs> look at this shit. <laughs> what Pe- happened? Pizza all over my fucking favorite pants, my expensive pants. Also wenn die teure Sonntagshose besser sauber bleiben soll, empfehle ich statt Pizza Pommendöner. Guten Appetit. You, you're pretty much into H.P. Lovecraft, right? Love H.P. Lovecraft. I cannot stop reading it over and over and over. This is like my fourth revisitation to Lovecraft. So it's like the older you get, the wiser you get, the more deeply the stories read. And, and you know, there's still that lingering, uh, what the fuck am I reading? You know, it, it's uh, it's worth it every second. What's your favorite story? That's then? impossible, but uh, that's impossible. I can't do it. That's like asking me like my favorite Mountains song. of Madness, maybe. Mountains or... of Madness is crazy, yeah. but uh, Shadow Over In's Mouth is fantastic. Uh, Color from Out of Space is fucking fantastic. Uh, and then uh, really the one of the most ghastly, I think, underrated ones would be the uh, strange case of Charles Dexter Ward. That fucking story of supreme ghouls is outlandish. You just wrote your own book, right? I ah, mean, there's an no, autobiography no. I, coming. I, I, it's it's still it's such the infancy stages. It's almost uh, makes me paranoid. You know, it's like fuck. You know, like, it's, it's due next year. So. So it's gonna come out in 2014 then. That's that's absolutely the goal. Yes. Talking about releases, um, let's talk about the elephant in the room. People are waiting for the next down EP. And last year, Kirk promised us that uh, the EP would come out in no time. So what's happening right yeah, now? Yeah, yeah. And you know, for, for us, considering that every motherfucking record has taken five years in between each other, it's like uh, we already have fantastic riffs. I think very good down riffs. And we're already talking about it. We're already working on it. We're already putting stuff together. So that's very encouraging for the down fan out there. And uh, I think it's going to be great. And I, I would predict early, early next year, within the first three months. Yeah. Why did you Why did you choose to to release or uh, four EPs in the first place and not an entire album? Because it's boring, man. I get bored with whole fucking albums, man. If I can concentrate on four, five, six songs and really make them the best that I can, I think it's it's worth it. And in theory, you know, it helps us get the material out quicker to the people because all of us are busy. I, I've been producing the new I Hate God, which obviously Jimmy's in. I just recorded new Crowbar. So uh, Crowbar has uh, two new songs and a live performance. Is it hard to um, to live up to people's expectations and still be uh, sort of innovative? You know? I, I don't care what other people think. I don't care what other people think. Honestly, I, I'm not. I don't care about fucking uh, what you call popularity contests. I don't care about fucking who makes more money, who's at the top, who's at the bottom, who's in between. Eventually, you know, I'm gonna uh, the solo band will have as many fucking fans as I get, whether it's a hundred or fifty or two hundred fifty. You know, at least when we play the shows, I know that everybody there will be there because they like the fucking song so to me that's that's the best part about it let the popularity contest belong to those that still chase it i'm 40 fucking five years old and too old to worry about that i haven't it's it's better to laugh at myself these days ha look <laughs> look at this shit <laughs> What happened? Pizza all over my fucking favorite pants, my expensive pants. So my to, stage outfit. To sum it all up, um, there's that new uh, solo album coming out. There's a, a new Down EP coming out. What else can people expect apart from the biography? Well, the we have the Horror Fest as well, and at the end of October in Austin, Texas, we have awesome bands playing, and we we're showing all a lot of old great classics especially the italian classics uh goblin uh the bad goblin, goblin is yeah. coming down they're gonna no shit, they're right? going to score suspiria while it plays they're gonna do a set of their own uh uh coffin joe's coming down george butkerite from Ger- uh, germany yeah, butkerite, yeah. yeah george butkerite for necromantic films he's coming down and to show 
the necrom necromantic movies and SRAM on 35 millimeter. Yeah, it's gonna be in Coffin Joe, man, from Brazil. Yeah. Coffin Joe. So it's it's gonna be a crazy great event, man. Thank you very, very much, man. Thank you. Thank you. Great interview, man. Falls euch dieses Interview gefallen hat, klickt doch einfach auf den Abo-Button. Jeden Dienstag und Freitag gibt es neue. Unsere heutige Frage an euch: Wie gefällt euch Phil's Solo-Album Walk Through Exits Only? Falls ihr Shirts, CDs oder DVDs von Pantera, Down oder Philip H. Anselmo and the Illegals haben wollt, die gibt es natürlich bei EMP. Klickt einfach auf den Link unten in der Beschreibung. Bis zum nächsten Mal, sagen Jan und Markus.